on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Let us pray. Lord our God, we praise you for your Son, Jesus Christ. He is Emmanuel, the hope of the peoples. He is the wisdom that teaches and guides us. He is the Savior of every nation. Lord God, let your blessing come upon us as we lift the candle of this wreath. May the wreath and its light be a sign of Christ's promise to bring us salvation. May you come quickly and not today. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Lord, our, our Father, our Redeemer, you are named forever. Why do you let us wander, O Lord, from your ways and harden our hearts so that we fear you now? Return for the sake of your servants, the tribes of your heritage. Oh, that you would rend the heavens and come down with the mountains quaking before you. While you wrought awesome deeds, we could not hope for it, such as they had not heard of from of old. The Lord be with you. The proclamation of the Holy Gospel, the good news according to Mark. Jesus. 
Jesus said to his disciples, be watchful, be alert. You do not know when the time will come. It'll be like a man traveling abroad. He leaves home and places his servants in charge, each with his own work, and orders the gatekeeper to keep on the watch. Watch therefore. You do not know when the Lord of the house is coming, whether in the evening, or at midnight, or at cockcrow, or in the morning. May I come suddenly and find you sleeping. That's your dear A, Matthew. That's your dear B, Mark. That's your E, Luke. And we use John throughout all three years. A new beginning. Usually beginnings are very wonderful in our lives. Think of some of the beginnings in your life. I think they all had one common denominator, and that was hope. Think of the moment you held your newborn daughter or son. Your hope for that newborn child, that this child would be healthy and happy and successful, to be a blessing to you and to many others. Think of the uh, first day perhaps you went off to college. For those who feel anxiety or despair, may the Holy Spirit help them in recognizing God as the reason for their hope. We pray to the Lord. For all of us gathered here on the first Sunday of Advent, may God enkindle in our hearts the Father, 